what is up boys it's been a little hot minute it's been a little hot minute since we picked up the camera and vlogged a little bit so we're back with another youtube video hope you guys are doing amazing i'm currently trying to do better obviously we're always trying to do better but um you know like i didn't really record anything in mexico because i was living in the moment i was being present and i feel like a lot of the time especially nowadays with the advancements of technology and all that shit we have a hard time doing that and i really tried to make an effort to try to enjoy it as much as possible however i am not huge into all-inclusive and that's something that i've realized and i don't think i'm gonna go on a vacation like that again just because you know, there's not enough for me to do and i need my mind constantly fucking stimulated because i'm like 99 percent sure i have adhd but it's like undiagnosed so call it what you want i wasn't a fan and my parents even told me they were like you know what I'm not even surprised uh when you were a kid we went to the dominican republic a all-inclusive resort and your favorite day was when we sat in the room and you got to play with your toys and i'm like yep yeah, that sounds about right because my favorite day was when i sat in my room and i played with my phone and myself i mean nope just kidding that was a joke comedy i'm such a funny guy but yeah like pretty much that's just uh how we were running it i wasn't feeling it so i didn't record anything sorry i don't really care if you guys are mad about it though because you can't really be mad at somebody for living in the moment being present uh today we got a back workout so that's gonna be fun we're gonna have a lot of fun times with that i got this new cable attachment it is the vulcan grip so we're gonna give that a spin on pullovers and on tricep pushdowns tomorrow i'm gonna have a whole like smorgasbord of just different shit in my bag to work out with so that's gonna be fucking sweet i was just putting my backpack away sorry about that um yeah that's just where we're at i'm totally out of it right now it's a long weekend right now, and I, oh, I'm so excited to go back to work. I'm so bored. Two days is enough. I don't need another one of doing nothing. I've been walking because I'm so bored. I got nothing to do, man. I got nothing to do. My town is boring, and that's just how the cookie grumbles. But, you know, uh, I'm going to catch you guys in the morning when we are getting ready for the gym. All right, good morning, y'all. Um, I just made my pre. I made a little pre-mix video, so you guys are already set up where uh, it's like it's like I'm remaking the video for my YouTube now. You guys are so special to me that I'm doing that. Uh, we have the Pump Daddy Candy Watermelon and then the Stim Daddy Candy Watermelon. There's no caffeine in the Pump Daddy, so that's why I took two scoops of pre today. And then we also mixed it with the organic, the Roar Organic cucumber watermelon electrolytes this shit is gonna get me a crazy pump because it's loaded with electrolytes and if you guys don't know electrolytes hydrate you which helps with the pump i also do just want to let y'all know right now that the cosmic brownie protein the little debbie cosmic brownie protein collaboration between little debbie and rise supplements is now live you guys can use code cart at checkout to save 15 percent of your orders and I really appreciate whenever you guys do. It helps out a shit ton. So thank you guys so much for using Code Cart at Retaliation and Rise Subs. Uh, we're wearing the Essential Compression today because it's back day. And this is my favorite compression. You know, it just looks Batman-y. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, so the Cosmic Browder Protein. I have unfortunately not tried it yet, but I have heard that it is very good. I heard it rivals Chocolate Cookie Blast in terms of chocolate flavor, but the person who told me is a very dark chocolate type of guy, so I'm not sure if I can really trust his opinion. However, Chocolate Cookie Blast is my favorite rice protein, so I'm assuming it's gonna be good. I'm assuming it's gonna measure up quite nicely. Why the fuck did I just do that? What's up, brother? Um, so we're gonna drink the rest of this, and then we got our back day going down. I got a couple of fun attachments that I want to bring to the gym today. We have a mag grip pull down and we also have the Vulcan grip that I showed you guys yesterday. So we're going to use those today. Uh, you know, spice up my back training, change it up slightly, even though it's pretty much the same movement. I just want different like sort of feel, you know, that's a really good thing about training. You kind of just change up 
whenever you want and it pretty much doesn't affect it too much. So make sure you guys have a little bit of variety, if you're, especially if you're getting bored of what you're doing. I personally was getting bored of what I was doing, so doing this is going to help kind of rekindle the fire between me and back. And I've always had a bad relationship with back because I don't like training it that much, but we're growing it. So yeah, gonna drink this, head to the gym. I'll catch you guys there. So we got the mag grip on. I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't know if the camera's picking that up, but uh, we're gonna go for like five to eight reps and then maybe do a back off. We got above our rep range that we wanted. I don't remember the exact number though, so. Skill issue. I think we got eight? I don't know. All right, so I got bad news already. Um, I forgot to record my first rowing movement, but it was just a seated high to low row, going like that, squeezing on the lower lat. Um, did two sets of that, six to eight reps. And then uh, now we got the JM press here. One of my favorite tricep exercises, but at the same time, not one of my favorite tricep exercises. It's a love-hate relationship to say the least. But uh, we're gonna go for, I don't even remember how many I got last time, but we're gonna go for a number for sure. We're gonna go for reps. More than one is preferred. Uh, okay, we're going for 10. 10 to 12. I'm okay with that. Uh, my arm is so fucking dry. I don't know if the camera's picking this up, but um, like you could see it a bit there. It's super fucking dry from Mexico and I've been applying moisturizer. It's been a week, me applying moisturizer religiously and nothing's changed. It actually got worse overnight. Like this is super dry here. So when I get home, I'm gonna have to coat myself in moisturizer to add some moistness to these arms. Cause uh, we just got tanned, we don't wanna lose it yet. And my back, my back is pretty bad too. And my chest and everything, everything's pretty bad. So we gotta apply it everywhere. All right, enough yapping, let's get into this. Oh my God. Make sure you guys do partials. After, when you're doing low volume, high intensity, push yourself past failure. All right, so next exercise we got up is cable rows. So I like to bend down like a little bit when I'm doing them like this. I feel it in my lats a little bit more. Complete bro science, but you know, you need a little bit of balance between real science and bro science and what works for you and what doesn't work for you. And this is just what I found gets the best contraction for my lats in terms of a cable row, especially with, I use the V-bar attachment, which also isn't entirely optimal, but I don't really care. You know, I, I don't have all the equipment in the world, so we're just working with what we got. So we got eight with 155 last time. We're doing 160. I reckon a couple reps. Son of a bitch, this is difficult. Just finished our lift. It was a good fucking lift, to be honest. I didn't record a lot of it, which is probably why it was such a good lift. I was dialed the fuck in the entire time, but um, that Vulcan grip that I showed you guys yesterday is so fucking good. 
if you guys have like an extra 25 bucks to spend on a cable attachment, I highly recommend you guys go and try that out because it is indeed fucking gas. It's gas, okay? I'm not even exaggerating. My favorite cable attachment, I think that I've ever used. And I've used a lot of cable attachments in my time, yeah. Being around as much as me, yeah, you, do, you tend to use a lot. But, um, this is my number four, this is my fourth favorite diet soda. It is a Diet Dr. Pepper, or a Zero Sugar Dr. Pepper, I should say. Dr. Pepper is a fucking classic. I don't even know what the flavor really is. I'm trying to read it. Caramel? Is it a caramel flavor? Because I taste like... I don't know. It's hard to put a pin exactly on what it is. I want to say it's like a like a cinnamon heart, sort of. I don't know. But that is definitely my number four favorite. Um, that's my fourth favorite diet soda. My first favorite is a diet Sprite. Love me a fucking diet Sprite, man. I love me a diet Sprite. And then my second favorite is the Diet Dr. Pepper in the strawberries and cream. The one time I had it, I wanted to literally sew my dick shut so I wouldn't piss it out. That was gross. Um, and my number three is a Diet Mountain Dew or a Zero Sugar Mountain Dew. That shit's just fucking phenomenal. You can't go wrong with it. Makes me feel like a fat kid again. So, uh, we're going to go home. We're going to eat up some food because we're hungry and we just finished a workout. We need to replenish our storages. We also got a little bio steel to replenish the electrolytes because, uh, oh my god, I'm so sorry. We have been fucking sweating like a motherfucker lately because the weather's getting hot and it's hot as fuck in the gym now, which is good and bad because the pumps are better, but I'm also sweating a shit ton and I'm icky after, like extremely icky as opposed to like my just like base ickiness. So we're going to go home, shower up, drink some electrolytes eat some food and uh we'll we'll see where the day takes us okay we're just gonna play it by year we're not rushing nothing hope you guys are having a beautiful day y'all i think i have a problem i think i have a problem am i about to play minecraft while watching minecraft yes are you gonna look the other way about it yes you're not gonna question this this is just how i get my inspiration for sick fucking builds that are badass right so pretty much i'm about to hop on the craft and i'm going to hop on my realm that i have no i'm not adding you to my realm i don't trust you but yeah we're gonna i'm actually gonna pause this youtube video i'm realizing that i'm talking over it and that must be fucking annoying so my bad my bad so yeah we're just gonna hop on we haven't played minecraft in a minute unfortunately i just haven't been playing i don't know why but we're gonna get back on the grind because overwatch has been driving me absolutely mad like up the wall like no belief so we're gonna hop on the minecraft grind again because it's nice and relaxing it is how i achieve calm thank you all so much for watching i'm sorry for the lack of uploads we're going to turn it back up we're going to be doing two videos a week for the next couple of weeks so thank you guys so much for watching make sure you like comment subscribe big announcement in the next youtube video so stay tuned for that i'm very excited to show you guys and tell you guys what i've got cooking in the back okay i got some stuff cooking in the back and i hope you're ready for it i love you all like, comment, subscribe, all that nice stuff. Code card at checkout for half natties and rise subs and retaliation. I'll catch you guys in the next one.